cancer is a genetic disease and uh, the basis for any kind of cancer is the variations that happen in the DNA and this has been the premise of all the latest drugs that have been identified and discovered for the last 10 years, 12 years which we call it as targeted therapies. Today in our lab at Medgenome uh, we perform several tests to identify the changes that happen in the tumor and inform the clinicians and the patients as to what are the changes in the tumor and what kind of specific treatments that can be given which will help the patients better respond to these treatments. This is completely different to what the conventional what we call chemotherapy uh, which was the mainstay for the last maybe 100 to 200 years which continues to help the patients alleviate the cancer symptoms but the targeted therapies of the precision medicine based on the DNA changes that we identify has completely changed the field of cancer therapy. Today there is a new form of treatment called immunotherapy where the about 29 to 30 percent of the patients who have high number of mutations in the tumor are benefited by immunotherapy and uh, we do a specific test called tumor mutation burden which basically checks the number of mutations present in a specific tumor. If the number of mutations are very high then we call it as tumor mutation burden high and FDA has approved certain immunotherapies especially like pembrolizumab and few other checkpoint inhibitors for immunotherapy for patients who are eligible based on the TMB high status. So if somebody has a tumor mutation burden and another biomarker called MSI or microsatellite instability, they are eligible for immunotherapy and they respond pretty well. All the cases with high tumor mutation burden respond pretty well, about 30% of them fairly respond very well for immunotherapy uh, treatments. So these are the new ones which are coming up recently. I think more research is happening, more targeted therapies, more precision medicine that will improve the overall survival, the overall quality of life for cancer patients which are on the anvil. Thank you.